Hey guys, it's Anne over at Plant Obsessed. And I'm going to look in on one of my bins that I've kind of just been feeding, honestly, whatever has been available. So I believe this is the bin where I put the, the old stuffing from Thanksgiving. So I thought I would look and see if I could find anything interesting in here such as they didn't like it, or maybe an outburst of weird uh, weird bugs or something. I'm not, not seeing anything weird though, and I'm also not seeing that stuffing. I just see a lot of happy little worms. Put in the comments below if you as I'm going through all of this, if you see any of the stuffing or components in here, I am not. It's not it doesn't smell weird or anything, which I was also concerned that it would get rancid or something. Hey, look at that. Haven't caught them doing that in a while. That's a couple of worms making more worms. They are all locked up, as Grant would say. And I'm gonna try and put them back under so they can continue on making me new worms. But it certainly looks like whether I've caught them or not, they certainly have been making me more worms. Let's see, I, I think this is a lemon or a lime. That's yeah, a lime. But I'm not seeing any evidence or weirdness. Sometimes when you put bread in a bin, you'll get this weird uh, blue mold and I'm not seeing any of that either. So that's good. Let's uh, move over to this portion and see on that side if there's anything, anything of note. But we do have a very nice concentration of worms in here. And I'm really pleased that there's not any weird smells or unfavorable bugs. And when I say unfavorable, it just means I don't want to see them. It doesn't mean they're not helping in the bin. All right. I should probably slow down feeding this thing. There's not, not a lot left. Maybe let them finish up. I was going to feed them some apple goo, but now I think I'm just gonna put the top back on and let them finish this up. Some of the tape from an Amazon box. So yeah, I think, I think these guys have probably got enough to keep them going. I'm just gonna bury up all the the things that haven't been eaten and then put their cardboard top on and, and let them go. I don't see any evidence of that stuffing or anything like that. All right, guys. Well, this is just a, a quick update on the one bin. I know that we had that little experiment going on with, you know, they ate the stuffing with the chicken and what would happen. And uh, it looks like they blew through it and didn't even flinch. So that's awesome. So it just seems like every time that I try and, at least logically, I mean, I'm not going crazy and, and putting like a whole chicken in here or something, but you know, if you do things little by little and, and in moderation, then it seems like the worms can handle just about anything. They've handled the, uh, the stuffing from Thanksgiving and so, you know, I think that encourages me to throw less in the garbage and throw more in the worm bin. Got a mango pit here that's nowhere near done. Uh, those take six months or so. And this looks like it's a corn cob that's completely unrecognizable. They are certainly working on it. All right, guys. Well, if you like the video, give me a muddy thumbs up. 
click subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and uh, ring that little uh, bell if you want to know what I'm doing when I'm doing it. But uh, thanks for hanging out with me and my worms and everybody have a good day.